Continuing coverage of the 114th Dog Diving Finals. The big story today, the amazing comeback of local hero Tom, the Con Ken Cocker Spaniel. And we are here at the end of the first round of the shore diving competition. Tom is coming up from behind from a shaky start. Malou in first, Bolton second. Earlier today, I talked with Tom's trainer and psychiatrist, and here's the interview. How would you say he's doing today? It's not bad for him because he stopped jumping more than two months. So he's pretty much been convalescing from yeah. a jump-related injury. Yeah, he's good by his age. Yeah. Now he's 42 years old. 42 years old. Yes. When compared with him. And here he goes again. Oh. He should go for his knee surgery. Orthoscopic surgery. This is uh, the same injury that sidelined Tiger Woods last year. But we should not blame him or we should not give him much more criticism. You're also a psychiatrist. and yeah. uh, I should give him some more positive yes. reinforcement. Oh. And there is Tom now, getting ready for his final dive of the event. If we look at the standings right now, you can see that Malou is still in first with 850, Bolt 720. Tom has yet to do his final dive, so he still might be able to make up these points. He's thinking about it right now. He's thinking about the jump in his head. He's waiting for the order. Oh. He is still uh, he's lost dealing with. Oh! Oh, I didn't expect that to happen. Oh, that was amazing. So let's take a look at that jump again in slow motion. Watch how Tom uses the full length of his body, propelling him into an awesome entry, followed by his characteristic splash effect. You almost can't get any better than that. And there's Tom's obsession with cleaning up the lake. He has always been obsessed with making sure the shore is clean before his dives. And here he is, going into the very final dive of the first round, the shore diving competition. Boom. And he's oh! I, oh! Oh, that is the most amazing jump I have seen this year so far! And there you see Shampoo, Tom's constant companion since they were puppies. Well, it can't get any closer than this. And now we are at the final event, the one meter bridge diving competition. And there is Malou watching from the shore, chained up right now. Tom and Malou are mortal enemies and any fighting would disqualify both of them from the competition. Oh, he faulted. That was a bad start. And that means that Tom has only one dive left. Now take a look at this. It was a pretty good dive, although his hind quarters wobbled a bit at the end there. And here we are, the very final dive. These are the moments that define both men and dogs alike. What could be going through Tom's mind at this very moment? The utter concentration. Oh! That is the most amazing dive I have ever seen in my entire life. And there he is on the sidelines, waiting for the judges to tally up their numbers. Will it be Tom or Malou? Tom showing no emotion at this moment as he usually does during these kinds of competitions. And there it is! Tom is this year's World Dog Diving Champion!
what an incredible journey this has been for Tom. For two years, he has struggled, trying to get back into the game after a devastating injury. And now, he has won the greatest championship any dog can hope for, World Dog Diving Champion.